A lot of people seem to be having some trouble with the custom sprites, so I thought I'd just do a fresh new tutorial. Now this one comes with a a key. So oop, I'll show you that. And I'll, I'll post it below in the description as well. Now what you're going to want to do is make sure that your active project is the folder for the custom sprites. And then after that, you can just load it. Now what I've done is I've basically just made my standard uh, walking thing, although I've added load and then GRP4 and then the name of my project followed by the last parameter is zero so that uh, the loading box doesn't pop up. Now let me show you how to save these things in the first place. I'm going to go down to Smile and Paint. And here I have my GRP. Now I'm over there in the bottom right hand corner you see Save. You're going to click that. You're going to save it as, you know, whatever name you want it to be and then it's going to save as GRP4. It's the, the fourth layer of the sprites and then uh, whatever you want to name it and then after you do that you know it's just as easy as just putting load up there load GRP4 and it works for uh, backgrounds and stuff like that as well because whenever you go into paint as you can see there is the SP is the GRP4 and then here's zero and one these are for they're just all sorts of graphics pages and if you have a question about any of this there is um, there's two videos there's a uh, walking the the original walking tutorial and then there's the part two that goes a little bit more in depth and that's how all of this works here